Brad at 14 0 down. What were you thinking and, and how did you turn it around from the position you were in? Um, well, they turned it, their players turned it around. That was just tough. Um, showed really good level of resilience and it reflected the bloke we were playing for, Reg. Um, he showed plenty of resilience for us over the last couple of seasons and a few things that he's had not go his way off the field. And, um, <clears throat> yeah, so it was a real tough, gritty performance. The fact that we were 14 0 down, they're a very good football team. And they, they're very dangerous with the ball and they're hard to handle. Um, and it's credit to our left edge there. Um, Morgan Harper and, and Blaze, they were able to adjust just to get our spacings right. And Blaze is only a kid. And he was able to not let it worry him and, and adjust his, his spacings. To, and then they shut it down for the rest of the game. How big a turning point was being, bringing on Junior? Like it felt, you know, it's just his straight yardage through the middle offloads. He gave you what he wanted at that point in time. Yeah. Like I'm, I'm really happy for Junior how he's playing, but I'm more happy for the group of the attitude Junior showed around. Well, he wants to start, yeah. but you know, look, it's best for the team at the moment that um, he comes on and changes the course of the game for us, which is what he's done three weeks in a row. Um, so he hasn't kicked stones about it. He's been a great leader um, for this team and this club. And there'll be times where I need the starting, um, but he's been very good for us off the bench. You mentioned Blaze. Pretty testing start to his yeah. NRL career, but seemed to get it right, got the try. What did you, what did you make of his performance? Yeah, it was good. It was tough. We, we got what we knew we'd get. Yeah. It was tough. He enjoyed the collision. He, he liked the physicality. He kept going after the game. You know, when he got a couple of things wrong, it didn't bother him. Um, so we, we knew we'd get all that, and he's only going to get better with the experience. Um, but pretty hard team to defend against, and he's done a pretty good job. Well, you still were playing for each day. Can you elaborate a bit more? Oh, he's just had a tough 12 months, Reedy, you know, like off the field. Um, and he's always, I don't know how he does it, but he just always puts his teammates first. Um, and we need to put him first today. You obviously had the black armbands on, that was... Yeah, look, it's been, mate, it's been tough. Um, you know, his, his mother and his brother and um, hasn't ever shied away from his responsibility for the team. And we, <coughs> we needed to repay him today. We was had to. It, was there ever a chance he wouldn't? Today? Nah, never. You shook your head straight away, Clint. What was? It? Nah, he would. He would never miss it. He's, um, as Brad said, he's he's put us first. I think we've built a culture where you want to come into training. It, it it gives you a space to get away from what's going on away from footy. And um, Reg is that type of guy that he would never, never want to let us down. And as Brad said, last twelve months have been pretty tough off the field for him, especially this week as well. So we love that bloke, and I think it showed today. <coughs> What were you thinking at 14 nil? Oh, same as what we did nil all. It's they're a great team. Turbo um, and Cherry on that right edge for them. It's we knew it was coming. We just didn't solve it early. And when we got a when we got the ball um, in play and, and played the footy we wanted to play, we knew it'd turn. And um, we dragged him into the type of game we wanted to for for the re the next 60 minutes. And um, we got the result. I reckon a few years ago, the reaction to being down 14 nil yeah. might have been different to what it is now with this team. Yep. Well, like Gutho said, 20 minutes into the game, we, there was only nine minutes of ball in play, which is not our style of footy. We want the footy, we want the ball um, in play a lot, and we, we knew if we just got some ball back, and we did, and we got some good field position. But I suppose the the thing that we've improved is just our level of composure and calmness. You know, we didn't go chasing the game with tr just trying to score tries. We we chased it through our our physicality and our effort. And we're able to, um, you know, come up with some points and then drag ourselves back into it and then come down to being tough and gritty to, to fight our way out of it because they're, they're a good team. They, they're going to beat plenty. Do you reckon you dodge one with that obstruction call in the second half? There? No, it's obstruction. You can't stop in the line. There was an obstruction before that, before half time where they got away with it anyway and, and scored, so it's obstruction. Could you, watch, <laughs> could you drag yourself away from New South Cup with your two boys playing? <laughs> no, it was, <laughs> early yeah. before the game. Yeah, no, that, yeah, there was about the NRL today, but yeah. Well, thanks. Thank you.